BRB. Okay. Yeah, my offline chat should be email only. Wait, hold. Oh, did we F for a second? Are we back? Type one if you can hear me. Type one, type one, type one. Type one. Don't scare me. Okay, you guys, okay. It's so, dude, I've never had that happen. It said OBS disconnected and then it instantly reconnected. Holy, I've never seen that. That was weird. <laughs> Woo, offline chat. <laughs> well, that was weird. Sometimes it does that. I've never had that happen. Dude, that's wild. Wait, is there two VODs now? Oh, no. Wait, hold. I need to check that. Oh, please don't tell me there's two streams. Oh, no. <gasps> there's two VODs. Dude, what the fuck? That's a bummer. Oh, no. That fucking sucks. Yeah, there's two VODs now. Damn. Oh, I hate... Shit. VOD watchers in shambles, yeah. Okay, well, hmm, that's fine. We'll have to figure out what the issue is. Yeah, it should be disconnected. God damn. Oh, it still says I've been live for four hours, though. Why is there two VODs? How did that happen? I don't know. Oh, you just got into... Hey, yo, welcome in, new people! Welcome in, evening frogs. We're probably a third or halfway through this painting. Ah, damn, that's a bummer. If you're new here, follow the stream, please. And if you're, uh, if you're already following chat, people, hey. Huh. Well, I'll need to troubleshoot that tonight, then. Because I matched all my settings from the main channel, like, all the scenes and all, like, the broadcasting settings, so I'll have to double-check everything, then. Did you guys see the offline screen at all? Dude, imagine we were talking about offline chat and then my stream ended. Yeah, I'm gonna clean off my brush a little bit. I thought you did it on purpose. No! Dude, ending a stream on purpose would be psychotic. Because usually when you end stream, you lose viewers. But it looks like we gained viewers. How? It's weird. But people, hey. Like I said, first stream is going to be scuffed. Not nearly as scuffed as my other first stream, but... I think that's the first time it got kind of scuffed, right? Otherwise, everything's been pretty solid. Dude, ending stream for a gag would literally be DOM. Like, even the big guys don't do that.
Maybe Twitch was like, hey, Megan, you've been painting for way too long. They were like, let's just end it for you. Oh, OBS did update today. I just remembered. I had to do an update when it installed this morning. Or when I opened it, rather. Sorry. Hmm. Maybe that has to be it. Because usually I don't have too many issues with OBS when it does update. So maybe that could be it. But, you know, at least we're back. We got back, like, instantly. No need to be alarmed. Everything is a-okay. I mean, could you guys hear the panic in my voice when I was like, oh my god, everybody type one if you can hear me. I got scared. His tech issues trigger me so much. Because, like, I don't get why, like, everything is the same every day, but, like, why does sometimes it doesn't work? Going back to the main point of the internet is not an infinite resource, but it still really bothers me when stuff doesn't work. It's like, I bought this machine to do said task, and now the machine is not doing the task, and then I get mad. I get really mad. Or maybe Twitch heard that I was like, oh my god, I'm going to post on Instagram, guys. And they're like, how dare peace and underscore art talk about another platform on our live streaming app to which. And then they clapped me through OBS. Conspiracy. Also, I don't know how to change the color correction on my overhead cam. Because I tried to apply filters, but this is the best color grading I could get. I might have to get, like, a third-party camera editor. Because since it's not DSLR, you can't change the settings through the actual camera feed. Okay, well, that's another round of grays done. Let's get a close-up. Yep. It's coming along quite nicely. You ask me. Okay. Oh, fuck. I can't make any paint right here in my arm. Let's get pulling this in my mouth. Go ahead and up the IG frogs or update the IG frogs. Okay, no fee cam. What if in one of these I show feed for funsies and they were like, oh my god, find the foot. <laughs> I'm kidding, of course, I'm kidding. Huh? <laughs> yeah, that would be a hot moment. But it'd be funny.
I always forget how much white you need to add to black to make it gray. that lighter oh yeah that's lighter not by much but still oh my god mark our airport music okay next round of grays You can only see the BTTV settings slash emotes. Uh, make sure you download all three extensions. Because 7 tv has a special emote menu. And you have to enable it through the Franker Phase Z setting, I think. Or 7TV setting. If you search it, like how to get the custom 7TV emote menu, I think it should tell you, like if you search it. Like, it's a very obscure menu setting to enable that secret emote menu. But I'm glad we converted you to a desktop viewer, finally. Okay. Bye, Lemon. We'll see you later. Thank you for hanging out today. Hope you have a good one, hon. Uh, you only see the settings for one. Um, You might have to refresh your browser. Like, refresh your tab.
Because otherwise, all three menus should pop up. Or not. Not all. Let me actually look. Oh, wait. I can't open Twitch on my desktop right now. It would take my stream. Um, hold. Yeah, I can't open Twitch right now. It would take my laptop. Um. But I think once you have all th three extensions properly downloaded, it should show, like, their menus, like, for each individual extension settings in the top right corner next to your profile icon. Also, keep in mind, the extensions only work on Google Chrome. So if you're not using Google Chrome, that could be why they're not all functioning. All you do is refresh. Okay, thank God. Because <laughs> I was like, I don't know how else to help you from there. <laughs> but I'm glad you tried the desktop extensions. Obviously, I keep saying this, but once you watch on desktop with those extensions, you can't go back. Literally nothing will top it. You're going to laugh back in the days when you were a mobile viewer, Andy. Okay, this is honestly coming along better than I thought it would. Like, once we have the super light grays filled in, it's going to look good. Because I don't want to, or no, rather, I still want to have some empty white spaces inside the final. But I want to use light of the grays to where they look like white.
Okay, I'm starting to get a blister right here on my finger. That means I'm gripping my paintbrush too hard. I need to calm down. There's so many emotes, it's so overwhelming. Yeah. It, it's one of those things where, like, there's all the emotes I have enabled, there's going to be some sort of. I have seven TV emotes enabled. So before, I used to have like 207 TV like 20 B2DV and then 20 Franker, but I moved them all to 7TV. That's why it looks like there's a lot, which there is. Um, But yes, Halloween emotes are only on the main channel for now. And I think either tonight or by next art stream, I'll have Halloween emotes on this channel for sure. I just didn't have time today because I think the Halloween emotes are good. Oh, but Cokes, you should probably be able to see, like, the custom emotes I made, right? Like the Meg winning, the Meg cry, all those. Because those were only 7 TV, I believe.
Yeah, make hyperspin is pretty solid. This emote has always been fun, yeah. <laughs> I feel like a lot of streamers, they don't download the emote extensions. Because they're like, oh, I'm not going to use it. But, like, emotes are for your chat room. They're not for you. Like, I know I like to have as many emotes enabled as I can. Because, like, they're for you guys. Like, they're to entertain you guys when I can't necessarily talk as much or... Just so you guys can goof and gaff with each other. And, like, I know a lot of people won't download them because of the Pepe memes. Or just, like, how Pepe was seen as a hate symbol at some point. I totally understand that argument. But it Pepe is, like, an integral part of Twitch culture. So it's kind of hard to not... Have it included in some way. And if you're against the Pepe stuff, still download the extensions. But just don't enable the Pepe ones. Easy. Like, there's a whole bunch of emotes with the extensions. And you can also make your own custom ones, like I did. I know I've seen some people, like other smaller creators, upload their sub emotes as like 7TV or third party extension emotes. And I think that's kind of silly. Because why would somebody subscribe to you if they can get the emotes through a free extension? Kind of silly. Like, I'll never upload like my original sub emotes as free emotes through extensions, but I'll upload, like, different versions, like the Meg Hyperspin. Because a Meg Hyperspin and then PSI2 Spin Spam goes kind of crazy. And, like, if you upload your sub emotes as free extension emotes, then it kind of devalues the people who do subscribe. So I'm like, why would I sub if I could just get that emote for free? It'd be a waste of money me as a consumer would think. Dude, imagine how crazy this piece would go if I did rainbow instead of grays. Like if instead I did this part black and then the lines rainbow. That'd go crazy. Next time. I know I said I don't want to do prints, but I can definitely make duplicate paintings. I think that's doable. Like, they would still obviously be the same price point. Because they would still be like an original. But it would just be a different version. But this type of pattern with rainbow I think would be really pretty.
Oh yeah, just solid black too. I think just solid black lines would be good, but I think like the an Omicron look. Or maybe like just monochrome with different shades of any color. Like if I did this piece in whole or solely red and sort of like maroon to then a bright red. Or like a pastel red. Cause I think the main focus of this piece is gonna be the color shift of the different lines. I know it doesn't come up well on camera, but Oh, I spilled paint here. Fuck. That's actually really bad that I spilled paint there. Hold, I'm scratching it off. Okay, I got most of it off because it's still kind of wet. Anyway, the main focus piece is going to be the color shift. Because, yes, the, the shape of the line does dictate movement. But the color shift also helps emphasize the movement implied by the lines. It almost looks like shading. Mm-hmm. Because the way that line work works, or cross-hatching, typically darker colors mean it's closer to you, when lighter colors means it's further away. Prime example, it's called atmosphere perspective. It's like, it's when you look at hills or a mountain and you can see that some are kind of blurry or kind of like less opaque. Your mind automatically assumes that it's further away because it's more cloudy or foggy. So when you use lighter tones like this next to each other, your brain thinks it's further away. So it makes you, it tricks yourself into thinking there's a level of depth, even though it's not fully shaded or rendered. That's why I personally appreciate black and white work a lot. Because in order to execute it proficiently, or effectively, you have to have proficiency in understanding depth and atmosphere, even if you're working on a 2D plane. Watch me bring out all the art terms. It's like I'm trying to write a school discussion post. <laughs> okay, that's another round of grays down. Grey's Anatomy. Wow. I kind of want to go full cam so I can actually see. I can't go full cam. Damn. Wow. We back to it. Back to work. Holy five hours. Jeez. It's been coming along nicely. Uh -huh. I wish I could work in a way to where the painting could be stationary. Because I love seeing the speed paint videos where it's them just moving their hand across like this, but it's like 10 times speed. And then you can actually see the image developing. But it's hard. I wouldn't be able to do speed paint videos because I turn the canvas a lot, unfortunately. No feet? No free feet. No, no. Okay, wait. You can, you can actually see the feet. <laughs> no free feet.
Dude, how do I... I'll turn this way. Back to work. It seems like it'd be a pain in the wrist to be stationary while painting. Mm-hmm. That's why shoutouts to all the speed painters out there. You're probably gonna give yourself carpal tunnel, but it's worth it for the hundred thousand likes, right? I think at the very end, I'm going to have to go over the red section one more time because I got, I have a few spots on it. Does the paint dry fast or is it tricky not to touch it? So I'm using acrylic. And the reason why I'm using acrylic is since I'm very mobile with how I work, I have to make sure whatever paint I'm using dries fairly quickly, like as you said, so I don't like drag it across it like you would graphite or like an oil paint. Um, so acrylic usually dries within five minutes. That's why you see me working like bottom to top and like rotating my canvas that way, because I write with my right hand. I'm working from left to right, that way I don't drag. So, that's why I like using acrylic. I also like how acrylic has like a matte finish. Because I personally like when things look flat. I really like solid fills. But since this is cheapy acrylic, it's not necessarily as opaque. Opaque meaning how translucent or how uh, matte a color is. So, acrylic is pretty opaque 
but it does require like one or two layers depending on how thick you paint it. Like you know how earlier with the red, the red sections, I had to put two layers to get like a really matte fill. Y'all should make flashcards. I'm whipping out all my art terms right now. Okay, hold my sister text me. We're going to get tested at the end of stream. Yep. Pop quiz. Dude, what? Dude, that could, Okay, somebody write this down. I could talk about art shit throughout stream, and then at the very end, we do a prediction. That way, you your choices have, like, impact. And then we actually do test questions. Then I could be an educational channel, right? I think my favorite part has to be this section because this part literally looks like a ribbon the way that the lines were formed it's perfect i wish i would like alt because like the way that the reason why this line looks that way is because i did the gradient on the top of the arch and then here on the inside of the arch that's how we have that ribbon effect So if I were to remake this piece, I would do ribbons on every single stroke. <laughs> yeah, this song was crazy. VOD watch is still in shambles. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think I might keep the music in VODs. I'm still thinking about it. Because, like, it's not like I'll get copyrighted. Uh, I think I think I'll just keep the music in VODs for now on. It's, like, not that it really matters. Because I, I generally don't think I'm going to do, like... I don't think I'm going to, like, edit any of these into any form of like be uploaded content. So after today's stream, VOD watchers will no longer be in shambles.
It would be cool if they did give affiliates channel points, though. Because I feel like a lot of people stream for a while before they do become affiliates. Like, imagine how many channel points you could get if they were available. Because, like, I streamed for six months. Like, imagine how many channel points my viewers would have. I assume it's just so, like, like, nobody can make an account immediately and, like, make inappropriate channel point redemptions. Because, like, the only time that people really see redemptions is during the stream. I don't think Twitch staff moderates that when people are offline. That, could, that actually could be why. Hmm. Because, like, when you do agree to be an affiliate, you obviously have to agree to follow terms of service. Exactly. Way too based cokes. That's another thing. It would incentivize people to watch your stream. I know that's why some jetters... I know some people say, like, they watch the stream at school. <laughs> or, like, do they just have it open on their phone just so they can collect the channel points? <laughs> like, obviously, that's an incentive for some people. And, like, Twitch should see it as, like, you know, more people will watch ads. Oh, wait, but affiliates don't get ads. They should just, okay, similar to YouTube, I think Twitch should just put ads on every single stream. But only give people the money when they get affiliate. That's what YouTube does, and I think that's totally fair. Because I know that incentivizes me as a creator to try and get, or be able
maybe going back to channel points, maybe people, for non-affiliates, they should let people earn channel points, but not spend them, maybe. I think that'd be a good workaround. Yeah, I agree. Limited things for non-affiliates I think would be great. Because there's like nothing that new streamers can get if they're not affiliated. Like there's no chat integrations, there's no predictions, no polls. There's nothing that encourages interactivity between the streamer and the chat room. It could be because Twitch sees it as non-affiliates are people who don't have a platform or people who potentially won't have a platform. But, you know, they can still have tools integrated to give them something. Because I know all the betas and stuff they're putting out, they're only for affiliates or they're only for partners. Which is fine, because I think the boost hype trains are only for partnered streamers, from what I've seen. I haven't seen any non-partner get a boost train. Because I think we've gotten two hype trains since the beta and we haven't gotten it yet. Which is fine, I don't care about the recommendation shit, but it'd be cool if they'd offered it to non-partners too. 
Okay, well, let's think about that. Recommending your stream to a thousand people. Can a non-partner streamer chat room actually handle that in terms of, like, having active mods? Probably not. Never mind. Good point. Good job, Twitch. <laughs> I apologize, Twitch staff, who might be watching. <laughs> Tanking. Hmm. Okay, I'm definitely gonna have to troubleshoot later. Because it's saying I'm at 2,000 bitrate when I should be at 6k. That's not right. Hmm. Anyway, back to work. Okay, that's another row of grays done. It's probably going to start going quicker because... Ah, uh, what you call it? There's less space to fill. Let's go full cam. Well, th dude, the saturation difference is insane between the two camera POVs. It's also getting darker in my room, so I might need to turn on my ring light. The only thing I didn't like about the ring light is that the way it's positioned, it costs, it casts a shadow from the camera tripod. Let's try it out real quick. Dude, my room is a mess. It's a goddamn mess. Just like my life. Okay. Let's be careful. Okay. Yeah, the shadow isn't as bad. It just makes this part really shiny, which is fine. I need more light anyway. Well, I think this is coming along beautifully. No repeat. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> I have to stand to the side now because it's brighter. Okay, no repeat. And you're still going. Yep, I'm crazy. Yeah, I agree. I haven't seen an increase in viewer count from boost streams either. Because all it does is recommend. I don't think people really click on recommended streams if they don't know who they are. So, good point. Painting is going to be like 12 fucking hours. Took me so long to type. That's okay, man. I'm I'm a slow typer too now. Okay. Yeah, why is my bitrate so fucked? Is my Ethernet plugged in? Yes. Everything's plugged in. I was like, I want to do a painting in one sitting. But if I'm going to do, like, more detailed pieces, it's probably going to take, like, multiple days. Which is fine, but not ideal.
Have you done big pieces like this before? No. That's why I was like, oh, I can get this done in two hours like a psycho. Because, like, I've never worked big because I was too worried that I'd mess up, like, a big canvas. Because canvases are expensive. They're, like I said, five to ten bucks each. So I didn't want to do big pieces until I felt confident enough. Dude, no wonder original paintings are so goddamn expensive. They take forever. I'm gonna drink some more water. I'm not drinking enough today. Am I? There you go. Oh wait, actually. Okay, there we go. Better. I've seen people take tens of not hundreds of hours of one painting. I know. That's not going to be me. Dude, stream ends when I finish the painting. Change the title mods. <laughs> I mean, that's a pretty good clickbait. Okay, the gradient of the grays. Gradient. Get it? Gray. Looks pretty good. I'm really happy with how the shades are coming out. Because it's not too drastic of a hue change or a shade change between each. Or it's not a huge tone change between each shade of gray. Like it's very subtle, but when you look at the gradient. I personally really like ombre. I remember from my ninth grade dance, I wanted to try and get an ombre dress, but we couldn't find one in my size. So I got a flower print one, and it was actually super extra. Everyone was surprised that I wore it, because like I'm, I was like super quiet back in junior high. That I had this like super... It was a cerulean blue, and it had this really bright color print, or sorry, floral print on the skirt. It was a really bold dress. We're definitely in for a subathon. <laughs> Dude, one sub equals one brush stroke starting now.
Or maybe instead of subs, what we can actually do, one bit equals one stroke. That way, 100 bits equals 100 strokes. Because this right here is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Dude, okay, I think one bit equals one stroke is a crazy idea. But then I would make that go crazy. I'm genuinely surprised my hands don't hurt as much. Automat, when I was automated, yeah. <laughs> Can you not type Lomao with like six O's too? Is that blocked? Somebody try it. I was gonna say, I forgot. Must have not been funny if I forgot what it was going to be. It doesn't work? Oh, sad. You. I'll fix it later. I love seeing Lamau and Chet.
Did you finish it? No, we're still alive, honey. <laughs> Dude, I can get this done in two hours. I'm insane. We're getting there. I'm probably like... Maybe... I mean, like I said, I'm not as tired as I thought I'd be, so I can still keep trekking along. How's your art piece coming, Lemon? <laughs> Streaming all day, yeah, basically. I mean, I don't mind it. I can do art all day and I'm fine. Oh my god, the Ludwig song! We don't talk about that. Talk about what? The art piece you're not- you're refusing to do? Even though you asked me for a prompt and then you're like, Oh, I'll draw a spider instead! And they're like, no way, the spider's too hard! I didn't like it. Oh, I feel that. Hashtag can relate.
than a six hour stream now? Yeah. <laughs> you know, Twitch streamers started union. We should advocate for an hourly wage. Dude, imagine how crazy that would be. I mean, I would very much gladly get paid hourly to stream instead of farming subs or bits. Like, all those YouTube contracts are like, hey, we'll give you this much every month if you stream X amount of hours. Dude, I would take that in a heartbeat. Because ultimately, that incentivizes people to stream more. I mean, it would only make sense if they offered that to, like, a partnered streamer. I don't think... It might actually be cost effective for them. I think if they offered, like, similar to, like, how waitresses or servers are paid, like, a lower hourly wage, but then tips. If you rent X amount of ads, but nobody wants to run fucking ads. I think it'd be interesting if they tried something like an hourly wage for partnered streamers. Like getting an hourly wage on top of bits or subs would be interesting, especially if they're cutting back sub revenue. I don't think it would be cost effective, but it would keep people on the platform. In my opinion. But look, that's another layer of grays down. Okay, I'm getting faster now. You know, this is the dream. Just painting all day, right? This is an artist's dream. We zooming now. Yeah, we zooming.
I wonder what's the longest stream I've done. Does anybody know? Oh, I think the longest stream I've done was the subathon, which was seven hours actual stream and then like an eight hours after thanking subs. Guys, do you think we could beat our... Is the stream getting blurry at all, guys? Because usually in bitrig tanks, like the screen, like if it's normally like 1080p, it'll look like it's blurry at like 480. Has it been doing that at all? Can't really tell. Okay. Well, if you can't tell, then that means it's not happening. Pro ad time? No, we don't have ads on this channel just yet. Surely we'll get it sometime. Because you would be able to tell if the bit rate tanked. Because <laughs> it, it looks like... If it's normally in 1080p, it would look like... um. You would be what Like... You know what's raining and your your front window is very like foggy or you can't see it all. It'd be like that if the bit rank tanked. It could be like the OBS update that's causing the issue, but as long as everything looks and sounds fine, it's okay. I'll just have to troubleshoot offline.
all the same settings as my main. Oh, I see. Wait, hold. I know why. I know why. Okay, it should be fine now because when... Oh, shit, that's why. <laughs> Everyone follow. I need channel points, yeah. Everybody show followers right now. If you follow right now, I'll destroy this painting. Hashtag not clickbait. I know why now. Um, Because when I change the audio setting to where it'll exclude the computer music, it changed my bitrate settings. That's stupid. Anyway, chatters, follow the stream. I promise next stream will be ten times better. Okay, chatters, it shouldn't stutter anymore. I'm the only one who can stutter here now. Dude, I didn't realize how many Sonic songs Ludwig used. Yeah, I agree. This one is solid. I think it's my favorite of all the songs he plays. Once again, shout out to the chatters who've been here the whole time. I know it's a long one. So thank you guys. I appreciate you guys a lot. I said it earlier, but I was super nervous to launch this channel, but I'm really glad I finally did it because out of everything, art is my, my passion. It's what I want to do. And if people understand. W for a stream, thank you. Thank you. W is a jet wagon. Wait, co Coax. Do you really not know Ludwig? Okay, chatters, chatters. Type one if you know who Ludwig is. If I see more than one, two, I'm gonna be mad. Because Ludwig is the one who inspired me, essentially, to just start streaming. Like, he was the first streamer I watched on Twitch. I mean, Ludwig is not a Twitch streamer anymore. He had a YouTube contract now. About a year ago. You only see YouTube clips? Yeah, that's how my friend knows him as well. You never watch his stream? I think, like, if you don't watch his streams, definitely watch his YouTube videos, because they're usually, like, highlights of his streams. Because the way he formats his stream is there's always, like, a premise to it. It's not usually just him playing a game. It's like him having a planned out bit or a gag. And I believe he and then a few other streamers launched a production company recently. 
their first production being juiced, hosted by XQC. Did anybody watch XQC's stream? I watched most of it, and it was okay. It's just a normal game show with your favorite streamer personalities. What kind of things he did, does he do? Um, He just, like, challenges, just chatting, um, gaming. Definitely watch. He streams on YouTube, so go sub to his YouTube. He's, I think, one of the best streamers that has come up recently. Not like an OG streamer, but... Who has, I think, deserves the success that they have. Yeah, guys, I think I'm only going to be able to do one painting a week. <laughs> uh, for chatters who are wondering what I'm going to do, if I'm able to sell. So the plan is by either January or spring, depending if there's a demand for it, I'm going to have a website and then But if we do auctions, then we can do an auction stream, which would kind of go crazy. Maybe do a painting with less lines next time? Shut up. Maybe you should finish the drawing you started earlier and then you quit. Got him. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Don't hate me. Nah, this one is taking a while because when you're doing tapered line art, like, you can't haphazardly hold your brush. If you do smaller canvases, want to take less time? Yes, but I want to work big. Because this is about... It's a 12 by 16. So like a fourth of my height. I want to work big. Because working big is fun. Yeah, easy clap. Get screwed, Lemon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so oopsie when we get uh when Maggie Sports gets a larger budget she'll Maggie Sports will personally purchase smaller canvases for chat
I think it also depends on what, um, on what, on, sorry, on what type of design, because you can't do some designs too small. Like, this one would be fine if it were smaller, like, if it were, like, this big, but you wouldn't get as many lines. What would a starting bid be like? Hmm. It depends on how many people want to participate. Because with an auction, you don't want to sell too many pieces, because unless you have a collector who wants to buy all of them. But I don't think any regular chatters here will be like that. Let's see. $25 per hour. I'd have to think. I'd probably have starting bid be at 75% the selling cost in the hopes that it would go above the selling cost. So, for example, if this painting took me, took me 5 hours, 5 times 25 is 125, I'd probably list it at 100 in the hopes of if I have maybe 2 or 3 bidders, it would hit 125 or possibly max 200. But an auction can go on indefinitely but if i were to auction a piece i would sell it or i would start it at like 75 percent the actual value i feel like that makes sense time on my hands so if we're just talking about raw supplies this probably costs like 20 bucks just for the canvas paint not even 20 bucks. So when you're purchasing art, you're basically paying for the time. And the time in which it, it, it spent them to gain the skill that they have. Because since I'm doing everything myself concerning streaming, I don't have to worry about compensating other people for their time, like i.e. like a social media manager or an editor. It's all me. So I don't necessarily need to worry about making quote unquote livable wages with either the main channel or this channel. So money isn't necessarily a huge concern. Because I don't really want to get to a point where I could make a living off of streaming. Because I feel like that would take the fun out of it. But then it's also like when you make money from it, it makes it more worthwhile in terms of like society's eyes of like how to spend your time. Because everybody's like, oh, you should be grinding. You should be like working three jobs. But then it's like, I physically can't work right now. honestly surprised because i think we asked chat earlier like how much an hour would be fair like there were some surprising numbers being spewed in chat like more like numbers more than i expected because like since i'm a beginner i cannot really beginner like i have some semblance of skill But I don't have the brand name in which to sell to a gallery if I wanted to.
It feels weird talking about money on stream. But I feel like people need to be more transparent about it. Even in a workplace, it's frowned upon to talk about your wages with others' employees. But that's because... For example, if I'm working at a fast food place and I make minimum, but I hear that someone who's only been working a month longer than me is making $2 more an hour at the same title, how is that fair? The reason why your employers don't want you to tell your coworkers your wage is because there are people who are unfairly getting raises just because they ask for it, even though they show no more merit than you do. And even if you work harder. That's why if someone asks me how much I make, I will tell them. I don't give a shit. Because ultimately, it's not my responsibility to pay my workers well. It's not. Definition of what they deemable is compensation for their time. So essentially, chatters, if we can get like the fru fru art people, like collectors in here. That'd be epic. Mod check collectors? Isn't it also kind of unfortunate how someone's art value increases after they pass away? It's really sad how they couldn't have seen that success when they were alive. Okay, another layer done. Whew. We're at six hours working time. Yep, exactly. When they die, they can't make any more art. Yeah, I see what you're saying, Coco, but like, that's why, like, I don't hang anything on my walls, because, like, not that my aesthetic changes all the time, but I don't know what type of look I want. It's like, I'm very much like, if I'm going to decorate my home, I want things to look nice together. Like, even if I like an individual piece, I'm not going to workshop the aesthetics of my room around the one piece. I think that's kind of crazy. Okay, no free feet? Like, it's different if it's a statement piece. Jesus, it's 7 o'clock. I'm really bummed that we have two VODs, though. It's gonna look unimpressive now. For next stream. Which might be next week, because I don't know if I want to stream paint this week again. <laughs>
I think this part pretty. Looks good. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for all the thumbs up. This almost looks like zebra print. Like this part right here, this corner.
I'm back in and you're still going. Love the determination. Yes. Yeah, stream ends. I'm changing the title. I'm changing the title. Because I, I probably got like another hour left. I know I've been saying that for the past, what, five fucking hours? Stream ends when I finish. Oh, they don't all fit. I'll take out the follower. Call. I don't need that. You're so silly, Lemon. My emotes aren't working. Refresh your tab. How am I not tired? You don't know. I'm fucking tired, dude. I, I did take my union break. I used the restroom. I had a hamburger. My sister texted me that dinner's ready, but, you know, I'm gonna keep going. You're on mobile? Oh, sometimes mobile is ass and sub emotes won't load. So, GG's. Watch on desktop, pleb. <laughs> <laughs> if you're new to stream, basically all my chatters are from my main channel. So we can give and get. If you are a new chatter, follow the stream. And I will be kind to you until we become close enough to where I can shit on you. And you can shit on me. Handshakes? I thought you'd be done by now. Screw you. I haven't been like too stressed. Like I've actually been pretty calm. That's the one thing I do like about art. It's definitely something that I do to relieve my stress. It's not often that art gives me stress. So, Chatters, if I can become a full-time art streamer, that'd be good for me. Like, my mental health would be through the rope in a good way. Like, I'd be so happy, I'd be flying through the clouds. Ooh, that taper was perfect! I <sighs> called to the limb? No, I... I don't think we can play that tonight. I, I, how long have we been live? Seven, guys. Our subathon was seven hours. I don't think... I think this is going to be the longest time. I think this is also the longest some chatters have watched one of my streams in one sitting. Shoutouts! Y'all are crazy. But thank you for spending time with me, Joel. <laughs> I see you found Joel, Coax. Yeah, no one can help you, Mac. Life is insufferable. Life is pain. It's emo hours, guys. Wait, I just realized, if it's 10 p.m. for me, it's probably late for some of y'all, right? Oopsie. I know, it's pitch black for me right now. I can't think of- or, no, I can't wait- Till we get sub emotes, because I have some good ideas for this channel. Because I said I was going to get illustrated ones, but I think I want to do more screenshot emotes. I think those would go crazy. I have, I have a few ideas. I'm not going to leak. But I promise you they'll be good. It's going to make the subs on my main channel. I want to sub to this one just to get the emotes. <laughs> Aware? Why is it? Oh, wait, you're saying a word because you've been here all day. Lol. <laughs> Imagine.
Yeah, chatters, feel free to spam as much as you want. Emote spam is encouraged here. Because emote spam makes me happy. If I see emotes in my chat, I feel better. Okay, that's another layers, layer of grays done. You can't sub with a prime here? No, Mac, you're supposed to give my main channel your prime. And then your tier one here. Easy. Because if someone tier ones, they're less likely, li likely to cancel their subscription. Pro tip. Wowie. This is so cool. Oh, did your subscription end? Haha. <laughs> Haha. <laughs> Imagine being a non peace and underscore 17 sub. Imagine. Haha. <laughs> Imagine watching the art stream and being a non sub. Imagine. Holy, it's seven. Oh, you're still a sub? Oh, never mind. No free feet? You know why I love emote spam? Look how active my chat room is right now. Look at them. They're going crazy. Whoa. Are you leaving them as a dead to them? Sag. Imagine not typing emotes. Could it be me? I hate how the white looks blue on camera. It shouldn't look like look. Back to work. Imagine painting all day. Couldn't be me. Oh, I just realized I didn't go for a bike ride today. Damn it. Okay, chatters, I want you guys to be honest. If I quit my main channel and just did art, would you guys still watch? Be honest.
Nodders. Okay, baddies a simp. Got it. This has been a long two hours. Shut up. Shut up. I know. I know, honey. Okay, I'm starting. I'm starting to feel the fatigue now. You know, I took my union ten, but I didn't take my my thirty minute after five hours. Yes, coax is a simp. I don't know. Yeah. Never mind. <laughs> no, because like. The reason why I start doing art initially on the main channel, old heads, no, but I used to do art after gaming every stream for like the first few months. So probably from like August to like October of 2021. But the, nobody watched the art streams because I didn't have any viewers initially. So the only reason why I'm launching this separate channel is because I know I'll get some crossover from the makes, like, as you saw, all the new followers and then all the viewers and chatters today have been from my main channel. We haven't had anybody new, which is fine. I don't expect new people because nobody, not many people are exploring the art tab on Twitch. If I genuinely wanted to get new viewers today, I would have been in just chatting. But, you know, I'm staying with my morals. I'm in the art category. Because I think, okay, chatters, for chatters who are here, what made you decide to come and watch the art stream? Is it because you like art? Is it because you like me? Is it because you want to support what I do? Please tell me. I mean, I assume if you're chatting, then you must like me to some capacity. Parasocially, of course. Because it's not often that you see your followers cross over to a new channel or cross over to like a different platform, like i.e. if I tell my chat to go follow my Twitter, not everyone will go follow. Otherwise, I'd have 600 followers on Twitter, like I do on Twitch. You're all right. Thank you, Mac. <laughs> no, but seriously, chatters, I'm doing free market research. What made you decide... Adding evil. Lying is an unforgivable act. I'll watch anything you do, to be honest. See, Mac is the dream viewer. I go live, Mac clicks the notification, and they watch the whole stream. Wait, <laughs> I get to post copy pastas? Yes. I hate how some streamers hate copy pastas. I genuinely think copy pastas are so funny. Mac has no life. Me too, man. Me too. I feel like any streamer doesn't have a life because all they. Wait, I actually want to copy and paste that and make a command. Holy. Oh, it's not going to load, damn. Okay, well, I'll just look through Batty's logs after stream, because that's like... It's just... Copy pushes. That's like literally what I said earlier, huh? <laughs> Holy. Okay, Batty is still my favorite chatter. This sounds like Patrick Stump a little bit.
Chatters, follow me! <laughs> Why are you saying, oh no? Oh, it's remixed? Well, the remix is pretty good. I never played any Sonic games. I wish I would have. As OG chatters know, the only console I had growing up was the Wii. So I didn't get to play any of the retro games. Unless I'd go to a friend's house, which wasn't very often. A big reason why I like copy pastas is, let's say for example, somebody says something bad, and if everybody just spams copy pasta, then nobody sees the bad message. That's also why I like regular emote spam. That's why whenever I use the bathroom or whatever, I tell you guys to spam PSI2 spin. That way. If somebody says something sus, then it'll be off the screen quickly if I can't come back and delete the message in time. You should definitely play Sonic 06. Why are you saying clueless? Is it bad? Or is it like Destiny 3? Nope. I think I've been wrong game. Far Cry 3 or some shit? Where like it doesn't have a sequel, like they just meme. Contrary to popular belief, I'm not a gamer. That's why I play the Switch games. That's why my Twitch bio and my main channel says I can't handle like a rage game. I would lose my mind. And I'm already losing my mind painting this. Stream ends when I finish this painting. Guys, it's good that we have a timer on screen. That way people coming in know that I've been streaming for five hours and not two and a half.
You have an update on the sketch you're doing? What is it? Oh, it's actually the worst Sonic game ever? Oh. Sag. Then I won't play it. Well, I'm feeling it now. Do you feel it now, Mr. Krabs? Holy. I decided to draw stick figures because I'm tired. <laughs> you think just because I'm tired, I'm going to do half-assed lines? I'm not. You should put your full effort in, Levin. I don't want to see no half-assed art from you, my pupil. I expect not the best, per se, but the best effort. lines like Mario Kart exactly You're using crayons why are you f nope <laughs> I was gonna say are you five but no don't self-report <laughs> Oh, I just realized I'm not going to be able to edit the compilation video today. Shit. Damn it. Does that mean I have to do it? I have either I either have to do it tomorrow morning or after stream tomorrow. God damn. Damn it. I was going to do that today. Damn, damn, damn. coming along oh you can see the gradient look at that the top is looking lovely okay let's update ig no free feet We've come a long way, yes. You would hope I'd get somewhat far into the piece after seven hours, huh? Holy. You know, I wish we were allowed to take, like, 30 minutes breaks or something. I think it's toxic how streamers are incentivized to stream for long periods of time without rest.
Okay, back to it. Okay, chat, if you can hear me, type 1. My chat room crashed. Never mind, it's back. <laughs> if you can hear me, type 1. Type 1, type 1. 1, okay, good. Sorry, my thing disconnected for a sec. Not my, like, the stream did disconnect, but my, my mod view crashed. Okay, I promise... Next art stream will go better because I, I fucked up the settings for this stream. But it will be better next time, I promise. I'm going to scream. I'm going to scream. I'm going to scream. Yeah, I can fix this. It comes off. If it's fresh. Saved. Saved. I caught it in time. Holy. Saved. If, you did, if you're if you listening, I dropped a blob of paint on the canvas, like right over the darker line, so I wouldn't have been able to touch it up. But I, I scraped it off in time. Holy. though i'm gonna know that there's a mistake there now um future collectors ignore the vod nothing happened painting is in good condition okay i'm gonna put some of this gray away in here i know this is probably not the best practice but if the shade is close enough, then I don't mind if it mixes in the bottle, because I ain't wasting anything. I know I could, like, saran wrap this, but I don't have enough time to right now. And I'm lazy. Don't listen to my art tips. I'm not a professional. Ignore me. And nothing to see here. No, Lemon, maybe we should try and type one at random times. I would just say a different number anytime the stream Fs, you goof. People just say one by default, but I would obviously say a different number. I would say, like, um, type 21. Is it ad time? I wish. I wish I could run ads. I'd make so much money off of you non-subs if I could run freaking ads. But I can't.
Do ads make more money than subs? No. I'm not allowed to say the amount I make from subs or ads, but I would have to say the money I made from subs is literally like a hundred times more than I made from ads for the whole month. Now, I assume Chad can do a little bit of math on their own, but just you think of it, a hundred times more I made from subs than ads, you can figure out ads is nothing unless you like average 1k. Ad revenue is basically ne negligible when compared to bits or subs. Like it sucks that I have to run ads, but you know, I gotta. Yeah, ads are D-O-M. I make literally dirt from ads. I couldn't even buy dirt with the money I make from ads. <laughs> but I'm still required to run the ad density that I have. Get back to work. Let's not mess up this time. I think that's the first big fuck up I've had. That's when you can tell I'm getting tired. Okay, so I think we have maybe one or two layers of gray after this run. Because this gray is basically white. The streamers only get a couple of cents from ads. I'm not going to say I agree, but that's the standard for most, including people my size. Okay, this gray is so light, I can barely see it against the white, but it's still there, I promise you. I'll sell you dirt for that price. Nah, we can get dirt for free. My parents go and offer up all the time, and there's so much free shit on there. At one point, there was a free kiln, which I wish we would have got, but we wouldn't have anywhere to play it, put it, to place it. Because the kiln was like a few thousand dollars. And it was a whole ass kiln that I used for like ceramics. Free. Granted, it was in need of a repair, but still free. What's my favorite insect? I really love beetles. You have a kiln in your house? Do you do ceramics? I know you said you wanted to get into like cricket shit, but do you do you do ceramics? Holy, I didn't know you did art. Why'd you keep this secret from me? I messed up my stick figure drawing. Well, try again. Did you not see how I dropped a glob of paint and then I saved my art piece? You can do the same.
kind of a bummer. That's why, like, I can never get into it. Because I get very discouraged when my work doesn't look good from the start. That's why I typically stay in, like, 2D mediums. Yeah, I've never had the opportunity to make ceramics at home, but I know for like our local colleges, you can like rent out a shelf space and then they'll fire it for you. And that's pretty cool. Because like at the farmer's market, I always ask like the pottery people what they do. Like some have a kiln at home, some do it through the college. Okay, it's another layer done. I think I just want to keep going. I'll I'll post an IG when it's done. Yeah, to have a craft room would go crazy. That's the dream.
Okay, this gray is it's right here. It's basically white, but it, I think it's somewhat, like the the lightest gray I can get. We're in the final stretch. Yeah, I can barely see the paint on the canvas because my my lights are so bright. Chatters, get ready to spam. I was here. You probably got like 20 minutes left. Dude, I thought I could get this done in two hours. I was huffing copium. Copium trick. But I do admit the grays are beautiful. What else should I add to my art, your mom? Oh, some of the grays are dry. Damn. I smeared on top of a line, so it's not noticeable, so I got lucky, but still, I need to be careful. Wait, what's worth it? Did I say something? Guys, I think I'm getting delirious. The lines are starting to move together. I'm kidding, I'm fine.
Oh, the grace in the painting? Oh, okay, good. <laughs> yeah, they're worth. Glad you think so. I'm starting to regret it. But, you know, I'm going to look at this final. I'm going to show my parents. They're like, you spent all day on this? And I'll be like, yeah. They'll be like, cool. Because my parents don't mind if I stream. It's just a matter of, like, I have to get my regular household stuff done. And then also, like, as long as I'm making adequate money from it. Like, I told my mom how much money I got through donations and subs for September. And she's like, whoa, that's a lot. I'm like, yeah. Thank you, chat. Also, shoutouts to Kobobo, our top gifter for September. Because I think Kobobo's gifted sub amount was, like, almost half of my sub count for the whole month. It's crazy. No, Kobobo, you're not allowed to do that again, ever again. Unless you become a millionaire, then that's fine. I'll take your money. But otherwise, not allowed. Okay, next round done. So I think I don't want to leave any white space. Yeah, not allowed. No more gifting. No, no. Unless. <laughs> any more suggestions for my picture? Um, you should draw me, like, slumped at the desk, because I am exhausted. I think that'd be very fitting. Okay, I'm speedrunning now. I do have to be careful, because now that I'm working quicker and there's less space to cover, the paint isn't fully dry, so I have to be very careful where I put my wrists. Should I draw two of you? Yeah, you should draw my my the spirit coming out of my body because I'm so exhausted. You know, make it artsy. Okay, now I gotta be careful. No smudging allowed on this piece. Not again. I can't afford another mess up. Oh, this song is in Scootish's Randy video. That's why it sounds so familiar. Yeah, 
Yes, we're reaching the final level, the final boss. Do you guys think I'll finish within eight hours? <laughs> no, this is Sonic. This whole playlist is Sonic. No way the rest will take me an hour, no shot. That'd be insanity. I've come this far. Yeah, this is Sonic. Okay, it's very hard to see this basically white gray on the white canvas. But you know what that means? It means my lines don't have to be nearly as clean. That's a plus. Peace I too. Guess. <laughs> Twitch, let us use follower emotes everywhere. Or at least in my channel here. It makes sense because, you know, this is my second channel. Okay, next round of grays. Holy.
I think I can get this done by 7.30. Or 7.30 make time. Not up time. We're in the final stretch, guys. My phone day. <laughs> Lol. It didn't feel that long? I know. That's the thing I love and hate about art, is that it's a nice way to pass the time, but you also spend a lot of time. It feels like I'm wasting my time if we're not making something productive. Did she answer the question? Of what? Did, are you debating me? You guys did not ask the question. Oh, is it okay if I at you? Yeah, you can you can at me. It's okay. Sorry, I missed your chat message. Lol. You can at me. I think people can at me. That's totally fine. I appreciate you asking. I think if you're going to at me, though, like, make sure it's relevant to me, I guess. I think it's cringe when people at me in TikTok comments. You're like, oh, at peace and clips. Look at this video. Ha ha. I think that's cringe. But adding me if it's content related to me, then go for it, dude. But I might not, like, retweet everything. I'll still, like, comment on it, and I'll still, like, like it if I like it. But I, I might not retweet everything. So don't feel bad. Don't go home, cry dead. Okay, this is literally white. This is literally white. Let's add a dab of gray. Let's add another dab of gray. People at you in random TikToks? Yeah, in the comments. It's usually people who follow me. Your photo takes up my whole phone. Me. Those lines are amazing. Thank you. You know, my lines are good in art and Mario Kart. Only 10 minutes? Dude, 10 minutes. I got a PB. Holy. I also need to touch up the red, so this this might be a 7.45, or maybe not a 7.30. I can show you Twitter. Oh, okay. 
Thank you. The gradient's crazy. Why is Max so nice now? Are they trying to win me over? I feel like they're doing something devious. Or maybe what... Because you know what earlier I said? You know, all the VOD watchers, honestly, you guys can just skip to the end. Maybe Mac is trying to appear like a good chatter just for the VOD watchers. Okay, only a few sections left. I did it. Your mom? Tomorrow starts my compilation of subbies for the sketch card. Thank you, Mac. You need better pictures, not gonna lie. I said this on stream on Saturday, but Mac literally sends me basically the same pose every month.
Wait. I fucked with the gradient. Because this one is darker than- I have to go over that line. Hold. I'll fix it. I mistakenly ruined the gradient. The gray- It's more gray than white on the previous lines. I have to touch them up. Nobody snitch. You can't tell on camera, but I'm looking at it from a different angle and the gray is not right. You know, I can't scam my potential buyer. I can't lie and say it's a gradient when it's not a true gradient. I would buy this for your room? Yes, Chatters, we have a buyer. We have our first sucker. <laughs> I'm kidding, of course. Unless... Yeah, the gradients do go kind of crazy. I really like how this one's coming out. Even though I fucked up this gray right here. I know that whenever you start, like, apprenticing or working at any paint studio, the first thing they have you do is mix colors, dude. I would die. I'm so serious. Hey, yo. Let's start the bid at a million dollars, then. <laughs> I'm kidding, of course. Unless... I mean, I just have to decide what my hourly rate is. Because this one is going to be a expensive ass one for nearly eight hours. Sheesh. That's a full time wage. You know, instead of painting, I could have done a full shift at Wendy's and got paid dog shit. How much you thinking to? I don't know. I, like I said, <coughs> sorry. Like I said, it have to be hourly rates, and I still need to decide what I want my hourly rate to be. So we can talk about the math when we're done, because I need to speed run. Okay. At minimum, I don't know. I, I gotta think, dude. I'm tired. Eight hours, no break. There's my Union 10. Because, like, my thing is, like, if I did this off stream, it'd be faster. So that's also something I need to take into consideration. Okay, the only sections left are these two. Because, like, if I didn't do this on stream, I'd, it'd probably cut off, like, an hour of make time. Because, like, I'm spending, like, one second glancing at chat and then reading chat for another five. So if we just tally up the time, I'd probably shave off an hour. That's another reason why I stopped doing art on the main channel after the first few months. Is because I spent so much time worried about stream that I didn't focus on my art as much as I wanted to. I felt like my art suffered. But now that I have less worry to feel like I need to be super extra and that I can be a bit more chill on cam, I definitely feel a bit more comfortable.
But honestly, how iconic would it be to buy something that was painted on stream? It's kind of like buying a memory, almost. Ah, oh, we passed 7.30, damn. <laughs> Make him go crazy, aren't ya? Makes me go crazy. A few more passes. Damn, I thought I could do 7.30. 7.45 for sure. As long as no more stalling. Might as well make it eight. Dude, I would die in Minecraft. Okay, the final section. But keep in mind, even if it's, I get the section that I still have to add red. Okay, lines are done. Lines are officially done. I forgot a line here. Fuck. Now I need to make that gray. God damn it. Okay. Let's add a little bit of gray to our white. Okay, that's good. Saved. Both lines are almost done now. One quick swoop. Actually, little touch-ups. Okay, gradient is officially done. Now all I need to do is do one final layer of black or red. Holy. Yeah, lines do go crazy. Okay, I'm gonna wash off my brush. It's been a while. I hope this gives chatters in general a greater, a greater appreciation for a traditional artist. Y'all don't realize how hard we have it. Oh, it looks lovely. So I'm looking at it from above. Okay, no, no selling. And <laughs> no free feet. <laughs> Oh shit, there is feet. <laughs> I gotta sound like this. Hmm. 
Would you guys be mad if I canceled the stream tomorrow? Thoughts? But then the non-art frogs would be confused. It's really hard to be a wealthy artist, yeah. Because, like, your profit with your time is not good. No? Okay. I I'll, I'll see how I feel tomorrow morning. I'm, I'm fucking tired. Those lines are better than your marker lines? Don't say you're joking. It's, it's fact. My marker lines are trash. And I got nine minutes. Okay, so I'm going to do one more coat of red and also make... Because this line... Because see how this is really thin and that's really thick? I want to bring that in a little bit. Okay, we're in the final stretch. I cannot afford any mess ups. If I spill this red, I'm going to scream. It'll form a good clip, but I, I, I cannot handle. We've spent seven, nearly eight hours. Animal Crossing again? Why? <laughs> I wouldn't be mad if you canceled. Thank you. Okay. Trying to find a bigger brush, but I don't have a, like a medium sized one. Should I sacrifice one of my ink brushes? I can always buy a new set. If you want to help me buy art supplies, you can toss a few bucks in the tip jar, maybe. <laughs> yeah, Tuesday is Mario Kart Animal Crossing, yeah. I'll see how I feel tomorrow, because, like, I'm honestly feeling really fatigued right now. Like, my arms are really heavy. Like, my fingers feel fine, but my arms are heavy. So, I think I just need a night's rest. If if that doesn't work, then I'll post on Twitter if I have to reschedule. Okay, final stretch. Another thing you'll notice that I do is see how I'm bringing my palette with me? Because the further you travel, the more likely you are to spill paint. Would that mean no art on Friday? Maybe. We'll see. Because Friday, I have to go to the doctor. So it depends on how I feel after the doctor. <laughs> if I'm depressed, then probably no art. My hand shifted. Get ready to spam, I was here. We're in the final stretch. <laughs> Cold to the limb. <laughs> what do you mean no way? What are you saying no way to? Yeah, we're going to lose the texture of the bigger strokes, but I, I kind of want a more matte look, so it's fine if we lose them. Because, like, the individual, like, black and gray strokes are matte. Because the paint I put down is fairly thick, so you wouldn't be able to see the individual strokes. That's why I'm trying to make this red section as matte as possible, or opaque, rather. <laughs> Meg's hand right now. Yeah, I'm on my final stretch. Maybe I can also swap out the wide-angle camera for the DSLR for, like, the actual art POV, the overhead. 
That way we can get better color correction because we don't necessarily need color correction on my face cam. So I'll, I'll try and mess around different angles and stuff over this first month of this channel. But this was a really good first stream. I remember seeing a 24 hour challenge on YouTube. Yeah, they go crazy. I think, what, how much uptime are we at? 8.30, yeah, this has been my longest ever stream. Because I think the subathon was like 8.13 after we thanked subs. So this, this is now my longest ever stream. Holy. I'll get this done in two hours, copium. I'm literally brain dead. Also, just because I finished painting it doesn't mean it's done. I still need to varnish it. But I have to wait for the paint to set for 24 hours before I varnish. Varnish is essentially essentially like a top coat. It kind of it accentuates the colors, make them slightly more saturated. I use a shine varnish or a gloss. That way, it looks shiny. Sorry, I misclicked. <laughs> Okay, guys, I'm not done. I'm not done. I'm not done. See, you can see, like, the difference. It's a lot more opaque now. Okay, now the other side. I, I have three minutes. I have three minutes. I have three minutes to PB. Holy... Okay, my finger, two of my fingers have blisters now. Hog you. Who needs a finger anyway? I'm trying my best not to say inappropriate things. This is still a 13 plus chat room. I need to calm down. Um, I met Scootish on a collab show. I was a last minute guest because people called out. So Cutie Lee offered me his tribute and then I was a last minute guest. Um, it was like basically like a lover host, but for small streamers. And I lost because I RP'd as a Yandere girl. And like, I had literally never met anybody in the group until day of. And I think people actually thought I was being weird, but I was just role-playing. I mean, Scootish and the host knew I was role-playing, but I think people actually thought I was weird. <laughs> but I, I like, the show was at, like, 3 p.m. my time, but I only knew that I was on at 11. And I prepped props. I had jokes lined up. I think controversial. I think I was the funniest person on. I know it's a bit ego of me to say that, but considering all the time I had prepared, like, what, four hours? I think I was the funniest. When was this? This was back in February. And I think out of everyone on that show, Scootish was the funniest. 
That's why I only really interact with it. What channel is it on? Uh, it was on Kotze Streams. They're currently on hiatus, but they might stream again in the future. They primarily did gaming and then collab shows with small streamers. I follow them on Twitter. Is there... No, the VOD is gone. <laughs> VODs usually only stay up for a week if you're a non-Twitch Prime or Twitch... Um, Turbo user, but if you have Twitch Prime or Twitch Turbo, then your VODs stay up for two months. So if it's from February, no, it's gone. <laughs> but I do have... I, I made a highlight reel on my YouTube VOD channel. I'll see if I can link it in chat for you tomorrow, Kobobo, if you want to watch it. Okay, I'm just going to touch up a few of these lines here. And then this will be done. Get ready to spam, guys. Give me like five more seconds. Done. Oh, damn it. I didn't do... Stop your timers. Damn. I thought I did 7.45. Saggy. Okay, well, guys, it's done. Whew. Is that how you met Emmy, too? I met Emmy through TikTok. It's a funny story. Yeah, chatters, I was here. Spam, I was here. I was here. I was here. Hi, YouTube. I was here. Holy, where'd my paper towel go? Guys, my sister is so mad at me. Probably because I didn't put the sheets on her bed. You missed what? Shut up. Shut up. Yeah, I was here. I was here, guys. I was here. Holy. Guys, I'm exhausted. Peace, I do YouTube. <laughs> okay, let's do a reveal now. Yeah, I still have to put the sheets on my bed. Holy. Hi, Emmy. Dude, you came in at the good part. We're doing the final reveal. Timer's done. Okay, I need a like a breather. I also need to like. Can you do the painting again? Watch the VOD. Easy clap. That scared me? What? How? Oh, when I put my head back? No, I'm fine. I'm fine. I've, I've never gotten to the point where I've passed out. That's never been a concern. Like, the only time I've gotten close is when I, like, I physically exert myself, so. The emote? Oh, Emmy's emote? Lamau. I told Emmy that she needed to add more screenshot emotes and then she made that for her discord and then i convinced her i was like please emmy for the love of god add it to your sub emotes and then she did and i love it nobody really uses it though in her chat she needs to encourage more emotes fam. anyway okay let's let the paint dry for like another minute and then i i can we can do close-ups it's so funny yeah it's pretty solid sleep stream time i'm never doing a sleep stream Unless I'm doing a collab with Amaranth, then I'd love to. <laughs> uh, dude, I chugged that shit. Okay, close up time. I think what I'll do is once the streams are over, I'll keep the title as is. And then I'll put a timestamp and be like, oh, skip to this uptime for a reveal. I think that's what I'll do for VOD watchers, just to make it easier for them. <clears throat> true. So true. So real and true. Okay, you guys ready for the big reveal? Okay, make sure to not touch the red part. The big reveal. Yeah, we'll show the sketch card in a second, huh? Thank you for reminding me. This is a 12 by 16 panel canvas. Oh, don't watch my chair. Let's get some close-ups. We can see there's a lovely gradient of black to basically white to gray that match the curvatures of the lines. A solid red fill in the background. 
the thing I like about this is that the lines are very natural. So even though like it's flat colors, it still looks somewhat organic. Let's get a distance POV. It go crazy, yeah. Only a true artist can do this, sure. See, look, I have like literally no room back here. It's amazing, thank you. People pog, wow. Wow, look at that on the wall. What did this look amazing in your living rooms? The mica powder really pops. Can you guys see the shimmer? I can't unsee the heart now. That is cute. Wouldn't this like, you know how people make paintings where they have like three like rectangular canvases, like skinnier rectangles, and then you put them together? I would love to do a series like that. I would sell that as a set though. Wow. Wowie wowzers. <laughs> okay. Let's see if we can get. Okay, wait, let me, let me get my, uh, phone camera. Let's see if we can, y'all can actually see the mica powder. Ooh, wow. Oh, but you guys can kind of see it. Big reveal. Yeah, so the mica powders is the full white background, and then all the other design is a full matte. I want to touch it. It feels very smooth. It's so freaking cool. Thank you. I want it for my room. Bid starting at a million subs. Any takers? Can I get a... Can I get a... Okay. Okay, Chatters, what would you rate it out of 10? A set would be so good, yeah. Guys, the dream is I can have a separate space for painting because I have to change this whole setup for gaming tomorrow, which is fine. The addition of the powder was a great idea. Thank you. Thank you. Because, like, I want to do something that's unique to some capacity. 9.9? .9? Ayo. Hey, 20 out of 10? You're lying. Kiss ass. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Um, oh, wait. We're going to do the comparison to the card. I forgot. So. <laughs> look how small it is. I think what I also want to do is I want, if somebody buys it, then I'll give them the card as well. Here's the original inspiration, the sketch card. I actually made this on a TikTok live back in April. And then the final. Look at that. Wow. Would you ever do another art style? I have to work on my style. Like, I would love to do, like, abstract type portraits. I think that'd be interesting. But I think for now, I think I want to practice with abstract. Because that's where I feel the most comfortable, especially when I need to get used to, like, holding a brush again, getting used to the medium, how it works. I really like this a lot. Sorry, I'm smiling. The gradient is insane, though. Like, I still think this corner is the best. Wait. Yeah, that corner. Okay, so chatters, let's talk about how long this took me. 7.47. Let's do the math. That's like a full-time job. Would I consider outlining the red? I think if I outline the red, because see how this part, it's, it's like the white gradient against the red. I feel like if I outlined the red in black, it would take away from that gradient. It would make it too harsh. Because, like, see how, like, on the curves, like, it looks nice where, like, the white is against the black where it's part of the curve? Because it kind of re-emphasizes this form as it moves. But if I did a black outline, it would make it too flat. 
if that makes sense. Or that's just how I see it in my brain. Okay, so chatters, I did the math. 7 hours and 47 minutes times 25 an hour would be 186. I was thinking 250 for this. Thoughts? Okay, 186, that's 25 an hour. That's not bad. I was, I, I, my guess was going to be 200. But that's less than my guess, so I think 187 is decent. In my head, this is flowing, yeah. I really like this part as well. It almost looks like wood grain, too. And 250 is fair. But look at it. The more I look at it, the more I like it, question mark. I hope you like it, weirdo. Okay. So, like I said, I... Oh, uh, talking about selling. I'm only going to sell products, paintings, if I can afford to safely mail them. Meaning, I would need a P.O. box. So... I'd have to have sustainable income to where I can pay 200 a month to rent out a P.O. box. So if either the main channel has consistent subs and bit revenue or ad revenue, or if I can, like, guarantee sell paintings every month, then I would open a P.O. box. So like I said, probably not till January, maybe springtime at the latest. Um... But yeah, so, because then by January, if we do a painting a week, I'd have 12 paintings. If I could sell, like, three, I'd be up 600, so. You can imagine the texture on your fingertips. I can say it's smooth. You can feel, like, the grooves of the paint. A peel box is that much? Yes, depending on how big it is. Because I wouldn't necessarily, because, like, you can rent out, like, a big space. Like, if you're going to receive packages. But, like, if you just need a peel box to mail out... You would you can like rent out a little box like those are obviously cheaper probably like fifty a month, but because like let's say somebody has to return it, that be that suck, but that's something you still need to consider. Because like the post office get mad gets mad at you if you have boxes that are bigger than your PO box. And also, it depends on what area you live in, since I live in a pretty populous area. Um, not many P.O. boxes are available, meaning they're always full, or when they are available, they're higher price point. Okay, chatters, I think we can end here. <laughs> Once again, think it's 8.40, holy. Okay, if I'm good. <coughs> if I'm going to do art shoes regularly... I have to start them earlier, meaning I'd start them at probably like 9 or 10 a.m. Or I don't know what time. It all depends on like how I feel in the day. Thank you so much. Sure. Thank you guys for hanging out. Um, sorry, I'm not, I'm not looking at camera because I'm disassociated right now. I'm, I'm tired. I'm genuinely tired. I did, I dead ass thought I could do this in two hours. I'm actually insane. Did y'all think this would take me this long? Be honest. Sorry. Okay, so. Veg, yeah. It's, I, 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 dude, I have so much to do. I have dishes. I have sheets. Laundry. No? Oh. <laughs> y'all thought wrong. Okay. Any chatters who were here? Was there anything I could improve on for this first stream for next time? Obviously, I need to adjust my OBS settings because I fucked up and did the wrong settings. So there should be no drop frames next time. Because this stream, since there's no, like, game capture cards, it's a lot easier on my processor. Um, camera? Yeah. I need to color correct the art cam. So it's either... Yeah, I hate how it's blue. Uh, there's nothing I can... I, I applied filters. It doesn't fucking work. So I think next time... I'll try and test out the DSLR for bird's eye view cam. And then we'll do wide angle this camera. I think we'll try that. More Twitch followers? Yeah, that'd be great. Um, Chatters, the best way you can support the channel for now, since we aren't affiliates, so I can't receive donations through Twitch. The best thing you can do, honestly, is if I go live, watch this stream. Um, feel free to chat lurk, like I said. Uh, if new people come in. And if they see an active chat, they're more likely to follow and chat themselves. So, email spam is encouraged when there's a dead chat. Um, subs. 
Dude, I, I told you, I, I can't do subs yet. I would if I could. I would farm so many subs. You know, I would even lie and say, if you're my top gifter, I'd make you a painting. That'd be crazy. Wait. What did that go crazy? Top gifter gets a painting. Mmm. Wait. Thoughts. Hold, hold, hold. Top gifter on my main channel for October gets a painting. That would go crazy. Wait, no, 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 no. They can choose any painting I already made and they get it for free. Dude, okay, that would be too much. That would go bananas, yeah. Imagine how many subs I could farm. <laughs> I would obviously be at a monetary loss. <laughs> Not just after last. No, I'm trolling. I wouldn't do this. I would announce it. Wait, we do it for December. December. Top gifter of December gets a free painting. Then you can choose from 12 paintings. Hmm. Then we can farm for Christmas. Hmm. Okay, we'll think about it. We'll talk about it. Um, what else? What else? Um, before I leave, before everybody in chat leaves, because no raid today, nobody's live. Instead of a raid, how about everybody go follow my main channel? I, th I think literally everybody is here from my main channel. But if you do happen to be new here and you aren't following, please follow this channel. Then you can chat next stream. And go follow my main channel. If, oh, that banner didn't come up. Huh. Anyway, if you are on Twitch desktop, you can click the follow button in chat. Or if you're watching on mobile, you can click that link and follow my main channel. It'd be great. Um. Uh, don't spam main. Oh, no. You found an everybody command. Oh, no. Oh, no. It worked. Yeah, because I have exclamation main as an everybody command. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, chatters, I'm going to head out. I, sh I hopefully... My eye hurts. Okay. Hopefully, peace I too pray, I'll be live tomorrow with Mari Kart. If not, I will for sure be live Wednesday. Hmm. I'm satisfied? Cool. I need to add a secret command here, huh? <laughs> okay. Anyway. Thank you to everybody who came to stream any chatters lurkers. Thank you to anybody who was here for the 8 hours and 48 minutes. You guys are crazy. In a nice way. Crazy nice. Thank you to everybody who came in, even if just for a little bit to say hi. I appreciate all the support. This is the first ever stream on this channel. I think it went very well. So thank you, everybody. I really genuinely appreciate all the support I've gotten on the main channel and on this concerning... Wait, does somebody have the copy pasta baddie made? Bot check baddie? <laughs> baddie, where's your copy pasta? No, it's too far back in the chat. Sadgy. Um, yeah, so genuinely thank you to everybody who watched the stream. Thank you for the new follows. We got Slime Beyond. Thank you, Batty. <laughs> um, we got Slime Beyond and Rainy. Thank you for the new follows today. <laughs> Guys are so dumb. <laughs> I love my chat. Chat's great. Okay. Anyway, I'll see you guys later. <laughs> okay. Wait, wait. Before I go, please, everybody, please, 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 if you like the stream, please, for the love of God, f go follow the new art accounts. I have separate accounts on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. Please go follow them. If you could get my, like, art pieces popping in Instagram, that'd be great. Sad Okay, your guys' command is socials. Because the way the commands work is if you accidentally type S in the chat, then it comes up as a command. There you go. Enjoy that command. Please, please, please go follow the Twitter. Please go follow the IG. 
if I can pop off an IG and get the actual art people in, I'll be set, okay? Anyway, I'll have high quality pictures uploaded on Instagram probably tomorrow. I have to wait for better lighting. Um, so look forward to that. Progress pics up or on IG. So look forward to that. Like I said, I should be live on my main channel, peace and underscore 17 at 11. If not, I'll post on Twitter to keep you guys posted. We finally reached the end, yes. Peace I27, it's over. Now my sister can go yell at me for not doing her sheets. <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys later. Okay, if I don't go live for Mario Kart, then I'll do a sub-only Cult of the Lamb. Handshakes? I really want to play Cult of the Lamb. If we don't, okay, if we don't do Mario Kart, then I'll do Cult of the Lamb all day. Because we didn't play today. I'm, I'm like, itching to play. Case of the Shake? Okay, cool. Okay, enough stalling. VOD watchers in shambles. Next VOD will have music in it, I promise. Okay. Bye. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye. Good night, baddie. Thank you for hanging out. You were here the whole stream, you crazy person. <laughs> crazy and nice, of course. Have a good night, man. Yes, I am obsessed with Cult of the Lamb. I'm insane. Dude, I, I still can't believe this took me eight goddamn hours. I'm still mad that my VOD got split in two. We have two four-hour VODs. I'm really mad. New ending stream? Yeah, this is the starting soon and ending screen. I might make a separate one. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Thoughts, thoughts. Good night, cooks. We'll see you later, hon. Thank you for hanging out for the whole stream. I appreciate you. Enjoy the new 7 TV emotes. Um, I think an idea for an ending screen would maybe have all the supplies, like, just in a mess. Like, purposely spill paint. I think that's a good idea. Because, you know, it'd be fitting. Like, you know, after you're done painting, it, it's, a, it's a mess. <laughs> really mad. Okay, bye, guys. Bye for real. I'll see you all later. Thank you, everybody. I genuinely appreciate all the nice chats, all the support today. Thank you guys a lot. I'm going to go cry because I'm tired, not because I'm happy. <laughs> okay. Bye, guys. Peace out to wave.